I was really fortunate to be able to be a member at Nakoma my whole life. Uh, got molded by the, the country club lifestyle and uh, got brought into a great bunch of guys. Um, Dad brought me under his wing, taught me uh, how to play golf, and met a lot of really great people. Um, so I'm honored, honored to be able to stay in town and play for the University of Wisconsin here. Uh, it's, it's, really, it's a really great honor. And uh, getting to play with the guys, I learned a lot. You know, learn how to handle business just like anywhere else. It's a, it's a, golf is a business game. And crack jokes, and you learn how to be respectful to elders and have a good time and that's that's what means the most to me for golf competition's great it's fun but the whole the whole aspect of it being a, a it's a people sport and that's that's who i am i'm a people person so it's a good time love it a uh, typical day wake up six o'clock ish six fifteen uh go to workouts uh, those are a couple days a week two to three days a week uh just as a team do more individually and then uh, those go until about 8 o'clock. Right after that we have breakfast. Right after breakfast I come back to my apartment, take a quick shower, have probably some more breakfast. Uh, make sure I have nothing else to do for the day homework wise. Go to class. Um, class usually goes until 2 or 3 o'clock. Right after class I gotta rush to the course. Um, if it's nice enough out to play golf, uh, we're in golf clothes all day. Um, then after practice we have a quick team meeting um, that goes will probably be done around six o'clock uh, after that drive back here it's about a 25 minute drive go to the library until about 11 maybe later depending on if you have a final <laughs> and, uh, and then repeat get as much sleep as you can don't tend to get a lot uh, days off I Sometimes we'll sit back with one of my roommates, uh, Connor and Jack, and we'll uh, play some Xbox and uh, hang out with some friends, do whatever, eat, sleep, catch up on that. Traveling, uh, the usual tournament is on a, either Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, or Monday, Tuesday. Um, so we'll leave, sometimes we'll leave Thursday night, sometimes Friday, and we'll get there practice round. So we're already missing some class Thursday and Friday. Um, and then we miss all of the weekend, so miss a lot of the fun with our friends, which is, I mean, that's something you have to give up. You have to know you're going to give that up as a college athlete. But then you miss Monday, Tuesday, and sometimes we've, we, this week, this spring, we've had five weeks in a row of that, uh, mostly. And it's hard. It's definitely hard. Uh, but that's what our great academic program here is, and they have great tutors and help us out a lot. So it's. You can balance it, but it's you gotta stay on top of things. It's easier to get ahead of things than climb your way out of a hole. I'd say a lot of the kids don't really realize how much physical um, work it is, how much we work out, how much we train. Um, I get the question, you know, why you're a golfer? Why do you work out? Why do you lift? And you look at the PGA Tour these days, and it's changed a lot in the last 20 years, uh, mostly due to Tiger Woods um, coming in and just becoming more physically fit than everybody. And uh, it clearly helps. I mean, you hit it further, you hit it more consistent, it's easier to play in the wind. So I think that's what people don't realize is how much we train. The University Ridge built this uh, great facility roughly five years ago, uh, just before Coach Burson got here uh, from South Carolina and we utilize it every day as much as possible. It's a, it's a place for the team to come and, and hang out and get better. And so we use the great study room and uh, try to utilize that as much as possible for our grades. Uh, behind the leader, Eddie White on the team, great student, and uh, I try to exemplify that to my peers and teammates as well. And then uh, we have the awesome uh, lounge area with the big screen TV and some couches. You can hang out, watch some basketball or other sporting events, cheer on the Badgers as much as possible and uh, be a team, you know, team camaraderie and get to know each other even better. And then uh, we come down to the practice green, putting green, chipping green, and the driving range and, and get to work and get better every day. Here it's AstroTurf, so it's a bit of a change going from there to grass. Um, but you can still hit every single same shot. The, the high flops, which you don't really use much in the rounds, 
Uh, they, those are limited here. Not much room underneath the, underneath the ball to swipe underneath it. Um, but you still can hit all sorts of chip shots. Every putt possible. I think it's 54 feet corner to corner. So hopefully you don't have too many longer than that in the, in the round. But uh, we do a couple workouts out here. More lighter weight, um, higher reps, a lot of legs and balance and core. Um, so coach uh, is a very healthy guy who studies these, uh, these workouts and we do a bunch of core exercises that are related to golf. So twisting and, and throwing balls and exploding out of, out of certain situations and uh, lunges there and back with weights and, and it's really good. I mean, your heart rate gets going and, uh, and to top it all off when you're, when you're in a bit of trouble or punishment for making a double bogey or say you lose a, lose a match out here. You have to do these things called gate runs. And gate runs are from this facility here all the way down to the front gate. That's about 0.8 miles and then back. And uh, it's one for every double bogey you make during a tournament. And that can add up quickly, let me tell you. <laughs> it, it's, a, it's a pain. It can be tough. So. Growing up in this town has shown me many great examples of Wisconsin student athletes. I am humbled to be able to join their title and will work to resemble all of what the University of Wisconsin stands for. There truly is no better honor than being able to wear the university colors and the Motion W in competition. I wouldn't be where I am today without the amount of support I have been thankful to have. I'd like to thank God for granting me the ability to just play this game. I'd like to thank my parents and siblings for supporting me throughout my entire life and golf career. I'd like to thank my many coaches I have had, especially the current coaches, Derek Schnarr, Coach Burson, and Coach Woodruff. And finally, thank you to my teammates for constantly being there for me in both the good and bad times. They are my new brothers and I couldn't ask for better ones.